I seen you were gonna work with King Von. Uh, I mean, I met King Von the night he died. You met him the night he died. Yeah, the day he died. Damn. I met him that day in in Sex. I met him that day in Sex. Yeah. He was telling me to come to the spot that he got killed at. Damn. I always felt like if I would have went, I would have stopped it. Cause I fuck with Kwan though, you know, and I and I and I was, you know, just met Von. I felt like I probably could have OG the situation, you know. I ain't go out that night. Damn, man. Uh, and and okay, so when you get the news, is that those are like the first thing that you think about? That's like, the first thing I thought about when I got the news. I was supposed to be there. Is there a reason why you didn't go? Uh, I just ain't feel like going out, bro. Just some was I was like, man, I ain't I ain't going out because I had just came back in town. I had my fit everything. Just ain't go out, bro. Just ain't get them keys and go out. You guys, so you guys never really got a chance to work together. Nah. No. How'd you feel about the King Von documentary? Uh. I didn't watch it, bro. I watched like the, I would probably watch 10 minutes of it. And that's because my partner was watching it. He was over there watching it. He put it on the dashboard. We pull up to Lennox and uh, that was it. When he came back in the car, we ain't watch it after that. I ain't, I ain't really get into it. I don't like, I don't like to get into YouTube talking about murder. You know, cause I know it'd be a lot of bullshit. Well, they did a documentary on you. Yeah. How'd you feel about that one? Um, I ain't like it. <laughs> I ain't like it. A lot of that shit be a lot of bullshit, bro. Like, people think they be knowing, but you don't know. You don't know. That's life. Nobody knows what somebody else did unless you were in the car. Uh, you did it. And these documentaries, I mean, they get millions of views too. Bro, man. It, it, it's sad, bro. It's sad, bro. Like, you know, what they do to people and people got kids, bro. People got kids. Make you, you don't even want to put your, that your little girl look on YouTube. You know, it's, they, 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 they heartless, bro. They heartless, you know. I was thinking about going to do a documentary of the people who doing it. <laughs> and lie about them and their family on documentary. I had started researching their kids' names, all kind of shit. My cousin, was, man, don't get into all that shit. You know, I had a private investigator looking at looking at his wife. You know, how would you like if I put a a, a documentary of of your wife and a doctor? Who she go get checkups with? How you like if I put your daughter school and where she goes to school at on social media and say I was just recording on your your, your wife picking her up from school? What if I say that your friend who over OD'd in college you gave him the drugs? Somebody, what if I say somebody saw you at the frat house leaving? When he OD. And I have no proof of that. That's what you're doing to us. Because everybody had people lose lives. Everybody. What if you get tied into it over? Because you make it seem so real how you tie it in. What if somebody did this to you and your family? See, that all they give a fuck about is clicks. That's all they give a fuck about, bro, is views, you know? So when somebody catch them and bat them in their face or knock their teeth out, the world should have no sympathy for them. It's no sympathy because you're not looking at the big picture. You're not looking at the big picture and that's all they do it for is, is likes. So somebody should bat them in their face, re refigure out their nose, and put them on social media for what? 
likes. That's how it's supposed to go. But the world, you know, the world different. They wouldn't be doing all this 90s, early 2000s. All these youth, all this shit going on with them, they, they wouldn't be doing it. They wouldn't be making DVDs with this on it back in 2000 or, or the late 90s. They wouldn't be, it wouldn't have the nuts to do it because nobody could be seeing what would happen to them. Now everybody got a camera, what we are afraid of. They wouldn't have the nuts to do this. Well, yeah, they, they get approached by the dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Back back in the early 2000s, so much happened and nothing got seen. Right. And they knew that. You were findable. It was the yellow pages. All kind, you were findable. People ran their cities. They doing it because what the world has turned into. If this was back in the game, they wouldn't be doing this to people. Yeah. Especially people who you say done done all this shit. You would be, you wouldn't think about it. You wouldn't think about it. What's up? This is Cam Capone. We got more content like this coming soon. So hit that like button, subscribe, and stay locked in to Cam Capone News.